Hi, welcome back for more Tales of Graces F, and this is take two of this episode because I forgot to save my game and I accidentally pressed load when I died. So, yeah, we're gonna continue on from here. In the last episode, uh, Richard went insane. Looked like he was being possessed after he almost presumably got almost killed. Don't know how he survived that. And now we are infiltrating Wallbridge in order to reclaim the Windor Kingdom. I believe we raised both the north and the south, uh, raised the north bridge and um, lowered the south bridge. And now we have to raise the south gate. And we are going to open the gate now. Alright, we did it. Let's go have a victory dance outside. Ah, what was that? I know that blade. It's Obi-Wan Kenobi. He has the high ground. I thought I taught you to maintain your guard until the battle is finished. Captain Malik. Using a small team to infiltrate the fortress and open the gate was an excellent strategy. But your endgame was weak. If I defeat you here, the tide of battle turns to me. Wouldn't you agree, your highness? You would threaten me, even knowing who I am. The knights have sided with the new king. Thus, this is my job. I've sworn to defend Prince Richard against all who oppose him. Even you, Captain. So be it, Asbel. Grant me no quarter, for you shall receive none. All right, we're gonna fight Captain Malik now. He is tough on Chaos Moon. But something we can't handle, I think. Just don't let him cast any spells. Like that, ow! Ow! Yes, Captain Malley can be spamming with them spells. Just don't let him cast the spell or get him away. Nope, you're not getting away from me. Nope. I want to be away from him because he has a Mystic Art. Like, oh, he almost used it. Right, let me just use an apple jar on myself. So I won't die. And we defeated Captain Malik. He gives a lot of XP and SP on Chaos Mode. Look at that. You've grown strong, Asbel. Captain. Your Highness! Duke Dolan reports that we have successfully taken the fortress! There is little point in further resistance. You know when you are beaten. This, at least, is an honorable trait. Richard, wait! Captain Malik was only doing what he thought was right! He could be a vital part of your kingdom when the war is over. I will decide who belongs in my kingdom! Uh, what's happening? What's wrong? No! This isn't me! Richard! I'm fine. Forgive me. I felt unwell for a moment. I'll decide the fate of these men later. For now, lock them in the fortress so they do not escape. Yes, sir! Richard? I must speak with Duke Dallin. 
It seems I may live to see another day after all. Asbel, though you did not complete your training, you have become a fine knight. Serve this country and Prince Richard well. Thank you, Captain. None of this would have been possible without your instruction. So, what happens to him? We fought on different sides, but he's still a citizen of Windor. I don't think they'll be too hard on him. I hope not. Anyway, what now? Do we go find Richard again, or what? Yeah, he said he was going to speak to Duke Dallin. Sharia. What? Sharia is down there. She is? Let's go take a look. Man, it's like there's no way you can get rid of that girl. But she is a good healer. See all Cher is doing. Oh wait, I thought she was here. Maybe she's down here. There we go. Asbel, what are you doing here? Oh, Sophie, I'm glad you're safe. I was so worried when the two of you left Lant. And you are? I'm Pascal. Totally nice to meet you, Sheria. Um, yes. Nice to meet you, as well. So what are you doing here? I joined a relief organization made up of volunteers from Lant. I wanted to help those who were hurt in the battle. A relief organization, huh? You came to a battlefield to help people? That's so totally noble and brave and stuff. Come on, let's take you to Richard. I'm sure he'll be willing to support your cause. He was gonna go see the Duke, right? So where's that? Oh. That was me. That will be the central tower. Sophie, I don't want to be rude, but your hair is filthy, and you're covered in dirt. Have you been bathing regularly? No. What? You're supposed to take care of her. I am taking care of her. But I mean, come on. There's only so much I can do, you know? Mm, I suppose. Look, I'll clean you all up soon, all right? Okay. Eh, it's not like skipping a few baths will kill you. Yes, it will. <laughs> Dirty people are unhealthy people. Everyone knows that. I'm going to scrub you both down later. You okay? You okay? Stop that. Don't mimic her. She's like their mother. Sherry is now accompanying you. Why is she accompanying me? She should be in the party. Alright, if I was them, I would be in the central tower. Ooh. Cut scene time. More soldiers are rallying to our cause after news of your highness's victory. I doubt even Archduke Cedric can match our strength now. The false king shall soon topple and fall. My dear uncle must be trembling in his boots. That's Richard? Asbel, you're here. Good. We've come a long way. When Verona falls, the war will be over. Then this country will know what it means to face true justice. Hmm? Who are you? Sherry Barnes. It's been a long time, Your Highness. Sherry, did you hear my appeal and come to join the fight? Uh, no, I... 
Fear not. Once I reclaim my throne, I will save the good people of Lot. Sharia came to help the wounded. Ah, excellent. I have many injured men, and your skills will be most welcome. Thank you. Healing our allies must be your top priority. As such, you may ignore the prisoners. What? Those who lend aid to my uncle are no better than beasts. Even their wounded deserve no mercy. They're still citizens of Windor. Those who stand against me have no place in my kingdom. Uh, but, Richard... Everyone must know the consequences of disloyalty. This is why I plan to have the traitors executed. They nearly killed me. Their crimes are unforgivable. Death is the only thing those scum deserve. Damn, Richard, you be edgy, man. Richard, no! You have to reconsider! Do you really think so, Asbel? They weren't fighting you because they wanted to. Only a coward would kill his own citizens out of fear. You dare lecture me on the rules of proper kingship? No, I'm just trying to help. Silence! I will hear no more of this! Do not forget your place simply because I have shown you kindness! Ugh. Your Highness! Ugh. Take His Highness inside, and fetch a doctor immediately! Asbel Lant, you are suspended from duty. We shall consider your recent behavior and decide an appropriate punishment. What's gotten into Richard? Are you and Richard fighting? But you're friends. Friends? Yeah, we're friends. But I just don't know what he's thinking anymore. I'm worried about him too. I know. He never used to get angry like that. His Highness has recovered. Also, we have decided to postpone a decision on the fate of the prisoners. For now, they will remain under guard here in Wallbridge. Thank you. You, however, are ordered to distance yourself from the Prince. Yes, sir. You are free to continue fighting for us but will no longer be afforded any special treatment. Understood, sir. Well, this day has been a little nuts. Oh, hey, Sharia. Are you all done zapping the wounded? So what you gonna do now, Asbel? From how the Duke spoke, I don't know how much longer I'll be welcome here. Will you go back to Lant? I have no place in Lant. You know that. But maybe if you talked it over... Why bother? I was never fit to rule anyway. That's not true. So, how are things in Lant right now? Well, Hubert is... He's doing a lot for the people. He was actually the one who suggested I start the relief organization. I see. All right. For now, I'll stay here and fight for Richard. Even if he's angry with me, I can still help. Plus, who knows? Maybe he'll change his mind or something. Um, do you mind if I come with you? If he invades the capital, there will be a lot of people who need our assistance. And I... I don't want to leave Sophie again. You know, I could take care of you too, if you just liked me. All right, if that's what you want, Sharia. Thank you. Sharia has joined the party. All right, now we have two healers in our party. It's me and the Charlie Angels, I see. Oops, I'm in the wrong place, in the wrong time. No, wait, why am I here? All right, let's.
All right, two common metals appear from the other mixer. Oh yeah, I put a couple of metals in there so I can make crystals easier, rather than just waiting for the crystals to appear. That's nice. Uh oh. On the orders of Duke Dallin, your team will be allowed to join us in battle. However, you will not belong to the regular army. Instead, you will function as an independent commando unit. I understand. Please tell the Duke and His Highness that we will do our best. An independent commando unit? Sounds like it just means we can do whatever we want! Sharia, Hubert, everyone has a place and a purpose. But what about me? Well, pouting about it won't change anything. For now, I'll just do what I can to help Richard. What is my purpose? What shall I do? All we can do is try to save those who's been wounded. To South Barona High Road we go. All right, hard to justify. You were right by Richard's side, Asbel. Couldn't you have stopped him? Come on, Sharia. Don't you feel bad for Richard? He was almost murdered by his own uncle. I'm trying to understand, but it's difficult. Is more fighting really the only solution? I can understand that you feel sorry for all the wounded, Sharia. But I don't think you're being very fair about this. Wait, you don't have to... <sighs> Oh, Asbel, can you not see that Richard was in the wrong here? Alright. Shiny. Seashell, a seashell, it's pretty. Oh, really? That's it? No more. A soldier here. The fate of Winter rests on this battle. We need every last man to fight as if, th as if there's no tomorrow. Ooh, acquired three peach gels. That's nice. Hey, what's this line for? Fendo didn't attack us, right? Oh lord, I hope not. Acquired 29 gold. The directions of... Oh, he still says the same thing. Okay, let's charge the mixer. Dualize? Actually, let me... Mixer. Let me remove the peach gel. Let me put peach. Grapes. And melon. What is this guy have to say? I'm not a fan of war, but sometimes you must fight to protect your own guys. Take care, you guys. Three, uh, three episodes. Take one, scratch the rest. What does this guy have to say? We're attempting to capture the main Barona gate, but we're stationed here until we receive the signal. Here's why. Here, why don't you take this, just in case you know. Panacea bottles, discard. Uh, this guy gives me an hourglass. Oh, wait. All we can do is now is fight. There is all to it. We must reclaim our own nation from Cedric and his valid band of upsurs. Life bottle, take two and discard the rest. There is no end. They told us not to go any further until the new orders arrive. Wait, here, take this. Now let's all get all this alive. Elixir. Justice is on our side in this battle. We must not be afraid to lay down our lives for this cause. All divide. Going commando. I was afraid of this. They've closed the gates to the capital. I don't see Richard anywhere. What should we do, Asbel? We're a commando unit, right? So we should just kick back and wait for something to commando. I don't want to hear that kind of talk. There has to be something we can do. Yeah, okay, Captain Bring Down. You should try having fun once in a while. Sorry. If Richard isn't here, then... 
There must be some other way of reaching the castle. Right? Yeah, good point. Let me think about it. Seven year blur. I hope Captain Malik's okay. You really love that Captain guy, huh? It's more than that. I respect him. He taught me all sorts of things about being a knight. So what's night school like anyway? Was it all fun and filled with teenage pranks or whatever? Not really. Actually, I didn't have a lot of time to goof off. No? The instructors and students were all working towards the same shared goal. My seven years there just kind of flew by. Well, that doesn't sound all that bad to me. What do you think, Sharia? <laughs> How would I know? Rawr! All this school talk rub you the wrong way? <laughs> trash. Ooh, more trash. Alright, that's a cutscene. As Belant, have you come here on His Highness's orders? What orders? Did the prince come this way? Yes, he took a squad inside just before you arrived. I see. Alright, let's follow them. Check. An apple. Back to the Baroda Catacombs we go. Two more common metals. Let me get that off the Elec Mixer. This Book of Swiftness is really hoping. We're traversing more ground than we need. Time at least, right? Now we can go through this area as we did seven years ago. Book of Perfection, a spell book that restores Elith that when you score no damage victory, set it to your Elith mixer. Check what's down here. Another chest. Mysterious liquid. A potential dangerous liquid. Your odds of surviving a single drop looked about 50 50. Acquired. Okay. Consecutive bolt, man. Chest here. What is this? Core dust. Dust is said to drop by. A defeated spirit. Discard. Chest here. Panacea bottle. Medicine that heals all physical ailments. It can only be used in battle. Discard. What's over here? Nothing here. Let's check what's over here. Uh, found more Elith units. All right, let's push down this door. What's down here? Oh, is this what I think it is? This leads back to the place that happened seven years ago. Two peaches in the Elec Mixer. All right. No skit here. And let us progress with the story i believe i saw one passage over there not too not too long ago and it's right over here push open acquired 1800 gold burial plans asbel what's a grave well, it's a place where dead people are buried. Why are they buried? It's kind of hard to explain. But when I die, I'll be buried in one too. You're going to die? <laughs> Hold on, I don't plan on dying anytime soon. Good, thinking about that makes me feel bad. But why do I feel that way? What you feel is normal, Sophie. No one wants to see anybody die. But Asbel, aren't we fighting other people? Well, 
Yeah, I guess we are. Sorry, I don't think I can help you make sense of that now. But I might have an answer for you someday. Ask me again when I'm older, alright? Okay, you can teach me once you know. Hmm, yeah, we are all scared to die one day. But before that, I believe I'm gonna save right here. And... Man, we... We defeated Captain Malik in Chaos Mode, that's really impressive. But, what will happen next? Will we meet up Richard and reclaim the kingdom? Maybe. But I'll see you guys in the next episode, and I'll see y'all later. Thank you.